everyone, I'm Dana Buckmere, the author of Plenty of Laughs, One Woman's Journey Navigating the Online Dating Waters. And I noticed when I get on camera that my hair is completely unruly and it's like beach hair don't care, right? So let's continue. <laughs> Bathroom selfies. Bathroom selfies are, um, is the topic today. Um, and it's a very relevant topic because on dating websites, you'll come across at least, I don't know, a million and one men that have a bathroom selfie. And I totally get it. The bathroom is an intimate place. You feel comfortable. You're alone. It's usually good lighting. You'd think that there are other rooms in the house worthy of taking a picture, but it is what it is. Like I said, the acknowledgement page of my book, uh, thank you to all the assholes I dated because you taught me, you, you, you there, I know who you are, you know who you are, taught me to make lemonade out of the sourest lemons. So let's make fucking lemonade, right? So with the bathroom selfie, it tells a narrative, right? Um, you get a little bit of information about a person that maybe they wouldn't be so forthcoming about sharing with you. For example, do they have two toothbrushes? Are there feminine products? Is the toilet seat up or down? What kind of decor do they have in their bathroom? You know, is it clean? Is it dirty? Um, all kinds of things. Is there lube? Any kind of freaky things that you can tell? Look at the, is there medication? Are there bottles around? What kind of crazy are you dealing with? Like there are so many things that you can tell from a bathroom selfie that will, you know, prevent a lot of heartbreak down the road. So these are things that you have to be aware of. And I'm going to read you an excerpt from chapter 28 of my book called, appropriately, Endless Bathroom Selfies. If you've ever perused an online dating website, you might have noticed that men seem to spend a lot of time in the bathroom. It made me wonder if there are any other rooms in the house worthy of taking a selfie in. Basically, what's up with all the bathroom pictures? Since I spent quite a bit of time on a dating website, I've become acquainted with my fair share of bathrooms. In doing so, I've compiled a list of a few things to keep an eye out for when inspecting the bathroom selfies of your future ex-boyfriend. Is there any indication that he might have a girlfriend from the products featured in his picture? Clear giveaways are, like I said, feminine products, makeup, a pristinely tidy bathroom. Not to say that men are slobs, but really, single men are slobs. You might think that just because you see products of the female persuasion doesn't necessarily mean that he has a girlfriend. Maybe the picture was taken at his mother's house, or maybe he has a female roommate. Either one doesn't score any points, okay? Does he still live with his mother or just go over her house to take shirtless bathroom selfies? And the female roommate is always problematic. I don't care how many time, times a guy tries to convince me that their female roommate is just a roommate. Eventually, one of them is going to get drunk and fuck, right? Everybody knows that happens. Nothing is platonic between a single man and a woman. So why do guys insist on taking bathroom selfies? I guess it all comes down to the lighting or maybe generally men don't feel comfortable taking pictures in other places. I don't know. But like I said, it is what it is. Let's make the best of the situation and try to get information and learn about that person from that picture. So think about that next time you're taking a bathroom selfie. Maybe you wanna hide that crazy medication or take away that extra toothbrush that indicates that you have a girlfriend and you're a player. Whatever you gotta do, you gotta do. But it's something to think about. And if you like what you heard and you think it's funny, you wanna read some more from my book, Please pick up my book, Plenty of Laughs, One Woman's Journey Navigating the Online Dating Waters. Everyone take care and stay tuned for my next adult story time video.